Welcome to Jimmy Bowen and Friends. Each week's episode features Jimmy Bowen and a special guest like Wade Hayes, Minnie Murphy, and Jeff Carson. Today's guest is Rhonda Vincent. Now, here's Jimmy Bowen. We have got a special guest tonight. I have known this lady probably for 30 or 35 years. I don't think she remembers it, but I do. Miss Rhonda Vincent. Y'all, that's going to be great. I am looking forward to that. It's going to be a lot of fun. We're going to have her up here next, right after this little break from our sponsor. You guys hang on. There's more Jimmy Bowen and Friends coming up right after this short break. Welcome back to Jimmy Bowen and Friends. Well, welcome back to the show. We have a we have a super guest tonight. This this lady I have known. She may not know this, but I've known her for probably thirty five years now. What? Uh, during our our my bluegrass days with the country gentleman, you were playing with your gorgeous mother and your dad, the Sally Mountain Show, and what music y'all put out. It was wonderful. Please make welcome Miss Rhonda Vincent to the show. Thank you. Rhonda, this is great. I, I appreciate you so much. It, it, it's an honor. Thank you so much for taking time out of your schedule to be with us tonight. Our pleasure. We, we so do appreciate you so much and your talents and the music that you do. And so tell us a little bit about what I let out the cat of the bag with your family, but how did you actually get started? What exactly sparked Rhonda to do it? Well, 
people say, you know, when did you choose this and, and as a career? But it's a way of life. My, as you witnessed, uh, music is traced back five generations of the Vincent family. So they were playing long before I was ever thought about. Yeah. And, and so we just continued that tradition. And, uh, I started singing when I was three. When I was five, we had a television show, a radio show, made our first recording, and that's when we were called the Sally Mountain Show. It was a local mm -hmm. show uh, there, but I ended up, and that was my grandpa, mom, dad, aunts, uncles, cousins, yeah. and friends, like Jimmy Bowen and friends. Right, yeah. So we were called the Sally Mountain Show. My grandfather passed, and it became mom and dad and I as the trio, as Sally Mountain Trio, and then Darren came, came along, along. and, and uh, Brian, and so we were the Sally Mountain Show once again. So, it, But my dad picked me up from school each day, and uh, we would play till dinner, and after dinner, friends came over, and we would play till bedtime. So yeah. it was a very concentrated life and, and a continuous life. Yeah. I would, we would do other things, but it always came back to the music. When you got home, you we're going to play, we're going to sing. Right. Well, now, the song that you're going to do tonight... The first one you're gonna do. Tell us a little about how this evolved. Called the song's called, called "I Ain't Been Nowhere," right? I so, ain't been nowhere. You know, nobody. We were we were we nowhere. We were nowhere in 2020. And uh, th so Chuck Mead took the song "I've Been Everywhere" that Hank Snow did, right. and he rewrote it. And uh, and I saw the video, and I said, "Oh my goodness, there needs to be a bluegrass version of this." And so we. Uh, I, if you listen to Chuck's version, I, I have the family version. I'll just say that much. So I had to change a few words. I put my, my husband talking about his, uh, his golf balls in yeah, there. Yeah. I put that in there. But I rewrote it just a, t a tiny bit. But Ch I credit Chuck Mead, and I appreciate. Uh, this has been such a fun song for us uh, to do. And we have a new video on this. Be sure to check that out. Check we that have out. a special guest. And Herb's in the video along with the, with the guys. And we have a special guest, Dolly Parton, Dolly Parton makes an appearance oh, in the video. Cool. So uh, be sure to go to Rhonda. <laughs> vincent.com and you can probably we'll find check a that link out. Yes, definitely, thank you. definitely all right you're gonna do that for us let's do it ladies and gentlemen Rhonda vincent and the rage <laughs>
But I ain't been no We're thrilled to be here with Jimmy Bowen and friends, though. Don't go away. Jimmy Bowen and friends will be right back. Welcome back to Jimmy Bowen and Friends. <laughs> Rhonda, you gotta tell everybody now how many words are in that song you just beautifully sang. How many? I actually counted them. There's 329 words, and I ain't been nowhere. <laughs> well, they want an encore. Will you do it again? Oh, again? <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, we won't do that. We won't have to do that. That'll be fine. <laughs> well, tell us about the song Unchained Melody. What's, what drove you to this song? And Because I heard you during rehearsal, and you do a beautiful job on it. Thank you. So what... what I would, have, I would have never thought I would ever record that song. Um, I think it was, you know, during 2020, I had never been at home with Herb. You know, we've been married now 38 years. Mm -hmm. And I would usually go out on the road. I would come back home. I'd be gone a few weeks. I was never home for weeks on end. Right. And so, and it was, it was so fun. We snuggled up and we were fishing. I was doing Facebook. I gave him a haircut. Hey, I could give you a haircut, Jimmy, if you I like. Know, that's <laughs> that's I'd rather have the Grammy nomination. Uh, <laughs> so, but, but we, we did all these fun things. And I started thinking, as we were working on this project, I started thinking, you know, we don't really do, is, we do songs about sad, how sadness and breaking right. up and this sort of thing, but we didn't really sing a song that really expressed mm -hmm. our love. And so I started to, he, when I sing it, he's like, oh, but uh, I didn't, because I just think it's, so, it's such a beautiful, romantic song. Many people will dance while we're singing it. Yeah. And uh, so, and it's become one of our most requested now. And it's, it was very challenging to sing, yeah. you know, because how many times have we heard this? Oh, yeah, yeah. I've heard it so many, and I thought, oh, you know, I can sing this. It took me 12 hours. This is just singing. I recorded 12 hours hours of vocals to get the vocal get on there. Going. So yeah. I don't know how it's going to go today. <laughs> <laughs> well, you do it just like you did in rehearsal and you'll do fine oh, with this. We'll try. We'll try. <laughs> let's, let's hear it. All right. Ladies and gentlemen, yeah. make welcome again Miss Ron Vincent and the Rage. Thank you. Wait for 
wait for me, wait for me. I'll be coming home, wait for me. Oh, my love, my darling, I've hungered for your touch. I'll back with more Jimmy Bowen and friends in just a moment. Welcome back to Jimmy Bowen and friends. Well, welcome back. What'd you think of Rhonda Vincent? <laughs> Man, she, she tore that Unchained Melody apart, didn't she? Man, that's such a great arrangement on that song. I wish her well with that one. She's a sweet lady. We're going to close the show out tonight. We appreciate you guys hanging out with us. And uh, this is an old Porter and Dolly song. And um, it's been done down through the years in Bluegrass Ways, too. The great Bobby and Sonny Osborne had it out on MCA Records years ago, I believe. And uh, um, they made their mark on it in the acoustic world. And Dolly and Porter made it very popular in the country world. We just kind of do it. We just like to do it. So we hope that you enjoy it. We'll see you guys on the next show. One called Making Plans. <laughs> Oh, 
making plans. 